Hello everyone, uh, hello and welcome you all to this new lecture and in this lecture I'm going to show you how to install the uh, latest upgrades or you can say how to update your EVNG to the latest version. Now you can see I'm running an EVNG on my ESXi server. Now you can be running on uh, this on any virtualized platform whether it being uh, on the uh, VMware Workstation Pro or maybe it is on the Hyper-V or you, are, you might be running this as a bare metal server. The process remains same. Okay, so the most important part of any upgrade is to basically back up everything, right? So you should, if you are in here, you should basically take some snapshots of your uh, virtual machine. If you are in uh, the Hyper-V, take a back, uh, backup or a snapshot of that uh, VM, whatever you're gonna upgrade. Uh, just in case if something goes wrong you have uh, a point where you can restore your vm back right so this is the most important part so i have uh, i mean done ssh to my um evng machine here and then i have prepared this uh, document so first thing you need to do is to check the version of your uh, evng right so copy this command which is uh, for ENG you can just right click and right click here and uh, the version you can see is 5.0.1 uh, that I am running so let's see after the upgrade um, do I um, get onto the latest uh, ENG version right so the first thing you checked is this one and then you have to free up your uh, ENG from older packages maybe you have some um, I mean packages lying down there so you just uh, uh, enter this command for me it was not there so that is fine after that you make sure you have a good amount of hard disk available on your space available on your hard disk with this df hyphen h and you see that this use column is not um, this one right this one is not in a, i mean free spaces should be here right okay so for me i have 45 gbs of available space so that is fine for me uh, next we will go and uh, check if I'm able to resolve or reach the internet so that is one of the major uh, uh, what do you say requirements because you will be downloading all the packages from the server a uh, public server so if you have a uh, DHCP enabled uh, this should be working for you but if you have a static IP so you need to uh, configure the DNS here uh, to check if it's running or not you just go here and then do a right click with the or even I can just type ping www.google.com and this is getting resolved and i'm uh, able to reach the destination address now after that the first thing you do is apt update is the first command so i'll uh, do a control c here and then apt update and then wait for this to complete after this is complete we will go ahead with the upgrade itself so i'll keep it copied okay once the update is done let's start the upgrade so once this is done you just uh, hit no here because this is mentioning the uh, base os sorry up update and then hit a yes here first of all Now on this, uh, what do you say, prompt, you see here, the action that you need to perform is no. So you'll say a uh, no here. okay so seems finally the update has been done now uh, let's go on and try the same command that we tried in the beginning 
and I don't see a new version here maybe we have to reboot first okay before proceeding we will reboot the system once and ping on basically this is my 240 okay so this is reachable now let me go on and ssh to the vm and i should be in yes okay so let me try the same command here i don't see the uh, version has been upgraded but let me check and this gui and access the vm I have to put it on HTTP so that is one thing you have to remember admin and EVE and enter okay so everything seems to be working now uh, but uh, the EVNG is still on the uh, 5.0.1 version and uh, basically this is the process to update your EVNG so if you have a upgrade uh, available uh, it will basically pull this uh, from the server otherwise it is going to remain the same and may uh, i mean it will it will go it is going to update a lot of uh, other files in the background not just the version is important so yeah so that's all for this video and uh, in this video you have learned how to upgrade the evng version to the latest version available on the server online basically so yeah, so that would be all for this video. I would see you in the next video. Until then, take care and bye-bye.